Good morning. Uh, this is our 2Y reading level video for Monday, June 1st. It is June. We are in the home stretch, friends. We are doing such a great job in our reading, our 2Y reading. Today, we are going to work on something new. We're going to work on two sound tricky consonants. What does that mean? That means that there are some letters that make uh, two different sounds so that they, they're the same letter but they can make two different sounds. Two of those letters are the letters C and the letters G. So what sound does our letter G make? I'm sorry, let's, um, what sound does our letter C make? K, 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 great job. We know that our letter C says k, but also our letter C says another sound. Our letter C can also say s, s, s. Let's give you some examples. So we have two pictures here. Hmm, what is this a picture of? A carrot. And what letter does carrot start with? The letter C. Because we know C says k, k, carrot. Remind me, what sound does C make? K, 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 k. Good job. All right, C. But also, hmm, what is this a picture of? A circle. Hmm, can you tell me what letter circle starts with? You might say S, but it also starts with a letter C. So carrot starts with C and circle starts with C. Say carrot for me. Carrot. Say circle for me. Circle. So in circle, what sound does the C make? S, good, S, circle. So we know the letter C can make two sounds. Hmm, can you tell me those two sounds that the letter C makes? Good job, C can say k, k, k. C can also say s, 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 carrot and circle, carrot circle. So the letter C can make two different sounds. Great job. We also have another letter that makes two different sounds. We have the letter G. G is another letter that makes two different sounds. Put that right here. The letter G. All right, we know the letter G says what? What sound does the letter G make? G, g, g. Great job, guys. We know G says g, g, g. We will also learn another sound that G makes. But let's start with this picture right here. What do we have a picture of right here? A glass. Glass. What letter does glass start with? G, g, g. Glass. Good job. Glass starts with G. Is this a uppercase G or is this a lowercase G? Right, good job. This is a uppercase G and our lowercase G is right over here. All right, g, g, glass. Say this word for me, glass. Glass, good job. Glass starts with the letter G. Glass, the G says g, g, g. Hmm, do you know another sound that G makes? Good, another sound that G makes is j, 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 like in giraffe. Giraffe starts with the letter G, but instead of g, this G says j, j, j. Giraffe, say this word for me, giraffe. Giraffe, good job. This G says j in giraffe. Hmm, okay, so I have my G. Can you tell me the two sounds that G makes? Good job, G says g, 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 and j, j, j. Great job for glass and giraffe. I want you to be thinking about other words that also make, have, that are similar to the C and G. Words that say k, k, or carrot, the C, or say s, like in circle. So there are other words that follow the same pattern where C can say k, 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 or C says s, 
Also for G, there are other words that make the G sound and words that make the J, J, J sound for G. So I want you to think of some of those words that make the K sound, the S sound for C, the G sound for G, or the J sound for G. Tomorrow, you will be writing your composition book, some more of those words. Okay, and then we will go over it on Wednesday for our lesson. More words that make the two sound tricky sounds. Okay, great job, guys. We're going to hop on over to our ARC bookshelf story, and we are going to read a book about cheetahs. Who loves cheetahs? I sure do. I love cheetahs. I think that they are such a unique animal. They're so cool to read and learn about. Cheetahs are super, super fast, right? Everything you hear about cheetahs is that they're so fast. I think cheetahs are so cool. So today we are going to read Cheetahs by Tracy Dibble. Remember, we need to figure out the pattern in the story. We need to figure out the new word on the page by using our initial consonant sounds. So let's go ahead. We need to identify the pattern and then figure out the new words. All right, let's read this um, sentence right here. I'll read it first and then you'll read it with me. See the cheetah with the babies. Say this with me. See the cheetah with the babies. Keep in mind the power words that you may see. We have been also practicing with some power words and I know that you guys, there's some power words in here. Keep in mind for those two. See the cheetah with the babies. All right, so next page, we need to figure out what the pattern is. See the cheetah with the eyes. Say this with me. See the cheetah with the eyes. Okay, so I know my pattern. See the cheetah with the will be the pattern. The new word will be this last word. So we need to figure out that new word on each page. Say the sentence again with me. See the cheetah with the eyes. And I can check my picture. This word matches the picture. These are the cheetah's eyes. All right, let's try the next page. All right, so we know what we're going to do. Read the pattern and figure out the new word. See the cheetah with the, all right, this, what is the first letter in this new word? E. And what sound does E make? Eh, eh, eh. All right, see the cheetah with the ear. E A R spells ear. Say this sentence with me. See the cheetah with the ear. Say the sentence on your own now. Good. And we can match this word to the picture. This is a picture of the cheetah's ear. So we know that this word is ear. Great job. See the cheetah with the, okay, our new word. What letter starts our new word? N, and what sound does N make? N, see the cheetah with the nose. And we can match this with our picture. All right, read the sentence with me. See the cheetah with the nose. All right, say this on your own. Good job. See the cheetah with the nose. Great job. All right, try this with me this time. See if we can figure out the pattern and figure out the new word together. Ready? See the cheetah with the t -t teeth. I saw that this was the letter T. I know T says t, 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 teeth. Say the sentence with me again. See the cheetah with the t, t, teeth. And I can match this with my picture. And these both match. I know this is the word teeth. See the cheetah with the teeth. Great job. All right, let's do this one together again. See the cheetah with the t -t tongue. And I can see that this is the tongue. And so I know that this is the word tongue. I identify the first letter, T. I know T says t -t 
Um, say the sentence with me. See the cheetah with the tongue. All right, say this one on your own. Good job. All right, do this one with me. See the cheetah with the first letter is H. What sound does H make? Huh, huh, hair. See the cheetah with the hair. Say this one on your own. Good job, guys. So we are identifying the new word. We are looking at the first letter, saying that sound of that letter, identifying that word based on the sound and matching it to the picture. Read this with me. See the cheetah with the Right, my new word starts with what letter here? S, and S says S. See the cheetah with the spots. Good job. See the cheetah with the, great. What letter does my new word start with? T, and what sound does T make? T, T, tail. Great job, guys. See the cheetah.